Understanding Bag of Flour, a simple English language guide. Hello everyone, today, we're going to explore the meaning and usage of the phrase, bag of flour. This might seem straightforward, but there are some interesting nuances to learn about. Whether you're an English language learner or just curious, this video will help you understand and use this phrase effectively. So, let's dive in. Firstly, let's talk about the literal meaning of bag of flour. A bag of flour is simply a container, usually made of paper or cloth, that is filled with flour. Flour, as most of you might know, is a powder obtained by grinding grains, typically wheat, and is used extensively in baking. The size of a bag of flour can vary, but it commonly holds about 1 to 5 kilograms or 2 to 10 pounds of flour. Now, let's look at how to use this phrase in everyday conversation. The phrase, bag of flour, is often used in contexts related to cooking or shopping. For example, could you please buy a bag of flour on your way home? This recipe requires half a bag of flour. In these sentences, the phrase is used in its most direct, literal sense. Interestingly, bag of flour can also be used metaphorically. In a figurative sense, it might refer to something that is bulky, heavy, or hard to manage. For instance, if someone says, carrying the old TV upstairs was like lugging a bag of flour, they mean that the TV was as heavy and awkward to carry as a big bag of flour would be. Sometimes, bag of flour appears in cultural references or idioms. In some English-speaking regions, you might hear phrases like, as useful as a bag of flour in a rainstorm, which humorously means something is not useful at all. However, such uses are less common and more region-specific. And that's all about the phrase, bag of flour. We hope this video has shed light on both the literal and metaphorical uses of this common phrase in English. Remember, understanding the context in which phrases are used is key to mastering a language. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.